Ladies and gentlemen, the day has finally come that I'm doing back-to-back -back new series on the channel. Also, bringing back Minecraft Pixelmon, yes! If you guys don't know, Pixelmon was really kind of what... There was multiple different factors, but Pixelmon was one of the major factors to my channel getting so large. And I am unbelievably excited to play this again. I, I really, really am. Now there was, I, I don't know the full story, I'll be honest here, but like Pixelmon was like banned or whatever, like Nintendo like was threatening or something weird like that. So they stopped, they stopped uh, updating it. They stopped uh, giving out the release to it or the, uh, the, the data to the mod pack basically. But now apparently it's all good. I don't fully understand it, but apparently it's all good and it's being updated again. So everyone is playing Pixelmon again, and we're joining the Pixelmon Let's Go server that is owned and operated. I don't know. It's, Vintage Beef owns it. There's two players on Tilted Wings and Finasu. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. I, I'm, I don't know everyone that's on the server. I don't know either of these two either. I just... Oh my god, I forgot about this. Hang on. This is a shirt, and this goes that way. All right, so this isn't going to be a normal Pixelmon Let's Play because I've done Pixelmon Let's Plays before, lots of them. This is going to be another challenge. I want to challenge myself recently. I like bettering myself. It's just a good feeling. I, I'm doing a Nuzlocke, which if you guys have are not uh, acquainted with the Pokemon uh, community of YouTube or Twitch or whatever, Nuzlocks are challenges where... You have to, you only get to capture one Pokemon per route. It's the first one you see, unless you've already caught that Pokemon, then you go to the next one that you haven't caught. And also, if one of your Pokemon faints, it's considered dead and you can't use it anymore. So it's a full challenge. Now, the Nuzlocke might not start this episode. We're going to see how, be, how far we're able to get this episode. I'm playing with this. This is like my little, this is like a little tripod. That's like my little fidget spinner. But we're going to be challenging ourselves very greatly with this. Instead of each route, it's going to be each biome uh, that we find. And the Nuzlocke isn't going to start until I get Pokeballs, enough of, there's a Pokemon spawn near me, um, until we get comfortable, like a comfortable amount of Pokeballs. Our starter gets to a good level. Now, if you guys don't know, Charizard is my favorite Pokemon, but we're not going to be doing that because I've done that many times before because Charizard is my favorite Pokemon. We're going to be smart about this. Now, I haven't had Froakie, Fennekin, or Chespin before. But I have to, I'm doing a Nuzlocke, so I have to be smart about this. We have to do a defensive mon. Now, what's a defensive mon, you might be asking? Multiple Pokemon here. But as far as defensive goes at the full evolution stage, there are good ones. There's Swampert, and there's Torterra. Those are the two that stand out to me the most. But the thing about, which is Mudkip and Turtwig, in case you're wondering. Both of those have four times weakness, which in a Nuzlocke, that's terrible. I think it's gotta be Bulbasaur. Nice little starting area. I didn't miss anything tonight. Welcome. Hello. Thank you. I need to fix some things really quick. I don't know a Pokemon that is around me. It sounds like a Klefki. Klefki is new to Pixelmon. If it is Klefki, of course. Uh, one other thing, chat settings. I don't like having chat so big. I like having, I don't know what I normally have it as, but I like having it small. I feel like a lot of times it takes up a lot of it. Is there a Klefki near me? Oh my god. Okay, hang on. Turn that down. Holy cow. Still not 100%. It is a Klefki! Something's taking damage around me. It's a Lediba. Okay, so we're just getting started out. What do all these signs say? I'm, kind of, I'm so excited. I'm so giddy. Follow path to Spawn Town. Spawn Town, negative 850, negative 100. Oh wow, it's, it's like 700 blocks that way. Oh, sweet. <laughs> I'm just taking it. I'm okay with that. I don't think anyone else cares. She's cosplaying as a Zangoose. Cool. Oh, Pat Rat. P Patrat, whatever it's called. Gen 5 sucked. Who cares? Wow, that is way too low. I will fix that. All right, we're just going to tackle him. He's he, The Nuzlocke hasn't started yet. Did I... Did he bite me? He used tackle. Okay, yeah, I'm dead. Cool. That was a really good start. Okay. Ah, that's much better. That's much better. All right, I'll meet you guys over at Spawn Town. I need to heal as well, which I don't think I saw a healing mechanism over there. Oh, wait, there's someone house over, someone's house over here. Maybe I could stop by and, you know, uh, heal up my Pokemans. It said no entry, but I still entered regardless. <laughs> I was like poking my head through the window like, oh, there's a, there's some good stuff over there. Hang on. <laughs> I don't know whose this is, but. <laughs> 
Hey, just look, I'm just healing. Okay, whose is this? Oh, still no idea. Sorry for entering, even though I wasn't supposed to. I had to, though. Wow, someone cleaned, except for that iron right there, cleaned this very well. Oh my god, level one. Yes, please. Give me, okay, or just attack me. Give me the literal minimum amount of XP I can possibly get. Um, we have seen... I'll take the string, why not? Um, we have seen a lot of low-level Pokemon. Like, for instance, the Patrat, the Ladiba, I think there were seven... Seven and eight. Don't want that on. Seven and eight uh, levels. That Scatterbug was level one. So maybe in the radius of spawn, all the Pokemon will be lower level. Like, the maximum might be ten. We did see trainer a trainer, though, that was like level 54 or something weird like that. So maybe it's not like that, but we'll take a look. Really, sign? Is there a Pokemon Center right there? <laughs> spawn Town is this way. All right, what level are you, buddy? Level one, perfect. God dang. Do I suck at throwing now? I haven't looked at my Bulbasaur either. I should be taking a look at that. You're not supposed to hit me. You're supposed to let me kill you. They give no XP either. Take all, sure. Uh, how do I check you again? Summary. You are... You have the overgrow ability. That's fine. It's kind of... I think that's the only one he can get. Look at the little Lillipup. Oh, Lillipup's new too! Uh, where is the stats? There we go. Minus special attack. Oh, Jolly Nature's not good. Oof. That's real bad. <laughs> That's real bad. Oh my god, if that mill tank's low level, that's so much XP. Please be level one. Please be level one. Starly's level one. Be level one. I don't think I can take it. I'm still gonna do it, but I don't think I can take it. We gotta hope that she does something weird. Oh my god, okay, yeah, there's no chance. It also has stab tackle. Oh my god, and I do no damage. Okay, we escaped. Whatever. We're gonna go heal again. Thank god that that sign told me where the Pokemon Center was, or else I'd never be able to find this. Bulbasaur's been updated too. I didn't even notice this. A lot of the models look so much better now. It makes me happy. Very few things in life make me happy, but updated Pokemon modules, models, whatever they are, feels good, man. I think you were level 8. You were too high for me. The issue against going against normal type Pokemon is they all have stab like tackle, which will beat me. But level 3 Mareeps, I should be able to beat. Mareep has the ability static, which paralyzed me, and I've failed my tackle two times in a row. I just want you to die. I just want you to die. Look, that's you not dying. That's an issue. That should be level 6. Beautiful. Oh, we got some, as great as I like to say, mutant. So another amazing thing about Pixelmon is this is a fantastic game mode or mod pack or whatever it is to actually stream. So tomorrow I'm going to be all day streaming that. Well, not all day. No, 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 no. Level 10. Run. Run. Thank you. Uh, no, he didn't attack me. We're good. But I'm going to be streaming this all day tomorrow and I'm very excited for that. I just want to grind on here. That's all I want to do. Oh, oh no. He has Intimidate. I escaped. I was not going to win that one. Especially with an Intimidate drop. Level 6, we're the same level. Level 5, I might be able to beat. But, you know what? Let's, let's just go to Spawn Town. Let's go take a look at that. Now, as far as the Nuzlocke goes, it's going to be the same thing. If a Pokemon faints, it's considered dead. We're going to be challenging someone at the end of every episode. I don't know if we're going to do it today. I'm gonna, Like I said, I'll see how far we get. It might start the next episode. But... We're going to be challenging someone at the end of it. And then also for finding a Pokemon in the wild, like in each biome, it's going to be whenever I enter a biome, it's going to be the first Pokemon I see. If I see two at the same time, then I'll just like flip a coin or something like that. And then I'll choose that one. Ah, it started raining. It's not supposed to happen. It's supposed to be a happy day. It's supposed to be sunshine and smiles. That's all it's supposed to be. Ooh, a plusle. Tornadus? Tornad, I, I never saw an anime episode with that Pokemon in it. I don't know if it's Tornadus or Tornadus. I'm going to call it Tornadus. I'm sorry. <coughs> it's one in Savannah. I don't think I'm near a Savannah. It must be one of the other two. This appears to be Spawn Town. One moment, please. I turned right off because Optifine's amazing. All right. This looks a lot better. You can see the particles are still there, but it's it's. I turned off the sound and all that kind of stuff too. Hi, Atkins. I heard you. Spider spawner in here. So there are mobs. I don't know if they spawn uh, generally though, or like in the wild or anything like that, or if it's just like spawners kind of spawn them. Level eight. All the Pokemon have been low levels, which is good. So I'm assuming the farther out we go the higher the level of the Pokemon will be. I assume. I don't know for a fact. So I didn't even notice on the bottom right. What does you do? Oh. Cool. I want the pink. I like the pink. Okay. Oh, I just... Okay. <laughs> that brings up the wiki. Did not know that. So all we have in here is Bulbasaur. Cool. That's new. 
<laughs> these are not new. Those have been in there for a while. My last pixel bouncers had that as well. These change colors, so I think you can do whatever. Okay. I'll... Oh, whoa. How do I close you again? Thank you. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to open you. I don't know how to close you. Okay. You know what? I'm just going to leave it open for the time being. I, I saw... I t what is that? Is that a Rotom? This is 100% used to... Yep. It's a mower. To uh, transform... I don't know whose base I'm in right now. Transform uh, Rotom's uh, typing and... Uh, I don't know, like item kind of deal thing? I don't know how to describe him. This is Spawn Town though. It looks very cute. I like it. Hi, Starly. Or Padove. My least favorite bird out of all the g Generation 5. We learned le Leech Seed, but. We, I, we wish it w Wow, that did a lot of damage. Was that Wing Attack? We wish that we had a uh, Razor Leaf instead, but nope. None of these are particularly good, so. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, what is this? Name. Vintage beef. Items for sale. Shiny magic carp. Oh, we are in business. Price another shiny. Shiny magic carp is the best shiny, in case you're wondering. It's the best. Uh Sten is trading a Mewtwo. A legendary I don't have. Dratini, whatever Dratini is whatever you think is fair. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I have nothing right now. Oh, Delta Wigs just caught the Tornadus. Tornadus, whatever it is. Alright. I'm gonna go on a grind for a little bit. Oh my god. Maybe we should explore more. People look like they're... Does it still do damage? People look like they are getting settled up on the server and doing their things. And really, really good builders. Which makes me feel very insecure about myself. Future police station. Oh boy. I'm gonna be in there, aren't I? We're very close. We're there. We're able to evolve them. I can cancel it, but nope, we got the Ivysaur. It was a pain. It was a, like, I kept battling trainers and they always had Pidgeotos and they would just destroy me. One dude had like a level six uh, Stoutland and I was like, why? What are you doing here, Tiger? Look at my little Ivysaur. Ivysaur. Let me see him. Ivysaur. Ivysaur. Hi, buddy. Are you like, you're not Pygmy. You're definitely not Pygmy, but you're definitely like small, right? I didn't pay much attention to that. Uh, where would that be? It's ordinary. Huh. Ordinary size. Did not expect that, honestly. Alright, I think I... What I'm gonna do now... Actually, I'm gonna keep grinding. I think that's a smart thing to do. I have noticed that since I've... Since I... Uh, Ivy Store now has started growing, the Pokemon around me have started growing in levels too. There's been a lot of 20 Pokemon level 20s, like this Raticate, for instance, which I should be able to take on. Maybe not. Okay, Growl... Yikes. Yikes, run. <laughs> the swords dance was, I was not gonna beat that. Nuzlocke hasn't started yet. I haven't gotten Pokeballs yet. Leave me alone. I've been sitting at spawn and I'm gonna continue sitting at spawn. So I mined up, well, grabbed all of these. I hope no one's mad at me. They'll grow back. It shouldn't be that big of a deal. But something that I did not do that I forgot to do in a Nuzlocke, you have to nickname all of your Pokemon because then you get more attached to them. So it was, it was a Bulbasaur. So I have to change his name. I'm very excited about this. This is what I've named my Bulbasaur multiple times. Bulba Fett. There we go. Now I feel a lot more attached to him. It's not just an Ivy Sword, it's Bulba Fett. Ooh, ooh, I haven't seen you yet. You're easy XP. I haven't seen like any water types, which sucks. They're both physical attacking, right? Razor leaves only disadvantages. It has 90, 95% accuracy versus 100. I'll take it. It's worth it. For that extra 15. Now, there's a few little tips I could give you guys if you're new to Pokemon. There is Stab, which is same type attack bonus. So if my... I, I kind of explained this earlier against normal types. If normal types are using Tackle, it's not just 50 power. It's 75 because the same type attack bonus goes up by 0.5%. Or by 50%, whatever you want to call it. 50%, so it goes up to 75 power, basically. Uh, Razor Leaf for Bul Bulbul Fett here uh, goes up to about 80, something like that. I don't want to do the math. It's too hard. Um, it goes up to about 80, which makes it very, very strong, which makes it better than my Tackle. My Tackle would normally do 50. My Razor Leaf is doing 85, the only, or 80, whatever it is. I don't know. Um, whatever. The only situation where I would not use Razor Leaf over Tackle would be if they resist or are immune 
to grass type Pokemon. Or if it's a grass type attacks. All right, the planes ain't spawning what it used to spawn. Well, it is still, that's the issue. I'm not getting that many levels from this anymore. So I'm kind of done with just sitting around here. Let's go find an area to build a base. Now, this isn't gonna be our house by any means. This is gonna be kind of like a little hole in the wall where I put a chest down and just hang out for the time being until I like get enough resources to actually build a nice looking house because I'm looking at everyone else's and it's making me clinically depressed. And I don't want to <laughs> start building a very, very sad looking house yet at all. Okay, so like I said, we're gonna go find ourselves a little hole in the wall, which looks like it's gonna be that little mountain right there. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. And you know what I haven't done yet? Is mine wood. I still, if you guys haven't checked out yesterday's video, I started a, 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 a series called Ultimate Iron Man, which is me trying to beat the Ender Dragon, aka beat Minecraft, with a certain challenge. That challenge in the first series I'm doing with it is no mining. So how do I get wood, you might be asking? How do I get cobblestone, you might be asking? Go watch the video. It's actually really, really fun to attempt to do. It's very hard, very hard. And I'm trying to do it without dying, which is much more difficult. All right, I feel like this is the best it's gonna get for the time being. It's just a little hole in the wall. It's just to stay, stay hey, here. Hey, come on, get out of here. Give me a hug, dude. I'm so glad you joined the server, finally, dude. My whole audience and all the comments were like, dude, I think it's like totally really unfair that H is not in the server when he's the one that knows most about Pokemon. So here we are and H is here. He's got his hole in the wall. This is how much he knows. He's got a chest. Holy, what? How do you have so many apricorns? Were you just farming over and over again at the spawn? Yeah. Dude, you did that. Why, like, why that is it that like I, I see you for the first time and you start hitting me with a sword? By what? the way, do you have any food? Are you kidding me? Are, are you are you serious? They're not. It's not as common on the server because you can't find chickens and stuff. Like you actually have to battle Pokemon to be able to do it. So y yeah. yeah. Have you not, Grazer? I just joined the server. You you know yeah. this, right? Yes, but you're better, dude. This is my way of learning Pixelmon, and I don't know it that well. So you're gonna teach me. There, you're gonna show me the ropes. There's brother. two chickens. Oh, I have to explain oh. it to you. No, I want to need more than that. I'm at one corn dog. I... <laughs> one more. <laughs> one more. Are you kidding me? <laughs> you're such a greedy little more. jerk. <laughs> Thank you. So welcome to the server, dude. What's up? Nothing. I just had a guy come in and take all my food because he doesn't right, have I'm anything. I'm taking a half your black. No, no, you're not. No, no you're no, not. No, the second one. Because I'm gonna make you some Ultra Balls. Let's get you some Pokemon. You know what I mean? Wait, do you have yellow Apricorn? Yeah, I got cooked yellow ones right here in my room, bro. Oh. oh, neat. Okay, dude, well, all I, I make are the Ultra Balls. They're the ones that work the best, in my opinion. Not oh, always. Holy! Yeah, he's grumpy What's your right favorite now? ball? What's your favorite ball? I like. I also saw that the Quick Ball could be pretty cool. They're all um, they're all very unique, and they're the Ultra I know, Ball is the safest the Ultra one to ball, have. But. Yes, exactly. I looked it up. Everyone else, every other ball has like a unique situation that it would be best in, but the Ultra Ball is just good for whenever. If you want so. to have like the two best, it's having like tons of Ultra Balls and tons of like Dusk Balls. Dusk Balls. What does Dusk do? They do better when you're like underground, and then when it's nighttime. So fifty percent of the time, oh. it's better than an Ultra Ball. Okay, I might want to make some of those then. Vintage Beef was telling me that the the, the Ultra Ball is by far the best. But it's it's anyways. usually the best. Like yeah. that's yeah. Welcome. Oh, to Grazer, the Grazer, town. Grazer, come over here. Yeah, but these are raw. Oh, just just, ru just ruin someone's it? crops. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, to be honest. Uh, it might sound surprising, but I actually did not mean to ruin their crops right there. <laughs> that sounds surprising. <laughs> All right, let me go ahead and hoe that back up. Oh, there you go. D take out the Captain Sparkles and don't craft a diamond hoe. You know what I'm saying? They're useless. Yeah. Don't? What do you mean? There's an achievement. Using up a whole diamond hoe. That's what it, it's useful it's, for. It's Captain Sparkles' like newest song. Oh, really? Yeah, it's called Useless. Wait, what? Is this new? Like today? No, this is like a few oh, months ago. I was like, geez. It's, a, it's I after this the music video. <laughs> it, it was after the uh, Gucci. Was it like the pump. Roblox one? Yeah. 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 Got you, got you. All right, so I got some potatoes. Anyways, what I did when I first joined is I used a lot of Captain Sparkle stuff. Why don't you mention him? Because he's got everything in his base already. And it's good to get that, you know, so you can get your Ultra Balls started and stuff. Why were you going into there, by the way? I, I need to heal my Pokemon. Oh, if you want to heal, over here is your bread and butter, as I, Beef would call it. 
This is your center. <laughs> yeah, I figured, but like most people already have like a, a thing Healers inside of inside, those. Yeah. Exactly. So I was just hoping this like, is... oh, convenient. Oh, actually, you're probably good to just use this place. You don't need to go to Count and Sparkles. So you could use the uh, mechanical anvil here. Here, put the I put put the black apricorns, um, in a furnace, not the mechanical anvil. I don't you have the black do... black apricorn. I thought you took it. Oh, you didn't cook them yet? You don't have, like, no. any cooked ones? No, I don't okay, have a furnace need, yet. <laughs> we're going to need a normal furnace, so we're going to have to go. Why does that place not have a furnace? Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Let me see. Oh, down here there's furnaces. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. Yeah, there what? Go. Whoa, what? There's, like, an elevator block. Yeah, oh. isn't that sick? <laughs> this is the storage room with the enchant table and stuff. Oh, neat. So, uh, do you have any Pokemon yet? I have just the starter. All right. Right click. I'm not trading with you. I know, I know what it does, Grazer. Also, I think you're. Wait, I think you're gonna really like the name of my Pokemon. You ready? Oh, what did you choose? Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur. Why do you always choose Bulbasaur? I've never chose Bulbasaur before. Let's go. Oh, you declined. Yeah, well, that's I my level why. 51 Pikachu. But I, this is I, the guy I want to level up the most. Do, do you this not see my guy's? My little Charmeleon. Do you see his nickname, Grazer? I really thought you'd like my his nickname. Bulbafet. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Thanks. Crazy game. I appreciate that. <laughs> it's really neat of you to laugh at my joke. <laughs> Did you yo, you need to give me the cooked yellow one so I can make your oh, thing. God, God. Why does why do Pokeballs take so long to craft? It's such a thing. It's, not, it's such a mission. It shouldn't be easy. I, I like well, that it takes longer. No, it's terrible. Oh no! What you I do? can't even help you. That's not surprising. Yeah, because yeah, you don't have iron. <laughs> no, I don't. So yeah, I guess take these lids or these discs and you can do that when you have the iron, but nice Pokemon, H. I'm so glad you're on the server. You're going to be able to teach me a lot of cool things. Do so you want to have a quiz here. right now? Yeah, I want to have a quiz, please. Okay. Quiz, quiz, quiz time. I want you to look at Bulbasaur, or Ivysaur now. Ivysaur? What typing do you think he is? He is a water type. I hope to God you are not serious. He's blue. That doesn't mean he's a water he, type. Or, or he's grass type, because he's got, like, the the grass. Use the, is that what it is? Well, that's one of his typings. He's two types. Uh, grass and... I don't know. I really don't know. Grass and, like... Oh, oh! It looks like poison ivy? Poison? Really? There you yeah! go. <laughs> Let's go! So oh, what? Like he's not fire. So what would he be? Su what would be super effective against him? Like what Pokemon? I, would you use I against don't him? know what is against like, like that let's, stuff. Let's, I need think, to learn that. Let's think obvious. What fire? Yes, there you go, Grazer. Why would fire? I just said that randomly, but why would that be against? It? I'm, I'm not battling you, Grazer. Go. Why? On. I'm a level thirty. You're level twenty three. This is pretty even. No, it's not. <laughs> not yes, at all. It is. No, it's not. Not at all. Oh, look at my little cute He's so cute. You. Stop hitting him. <laughs> well, I passed the quiz, I guess. Kind of, yeah. Uh, here, take oh, these yellow guys. I'll let you have them. Oh, did you go up here? Yeah, oh, hi. I <laughs> Where are you? I, I, like, went up twice. It was really weird. Hey, take these. Thank and you. And take all the junk that I Okay. I, I mean, I actually fine. I'll take it. <laughs> I like how you gave me food after I just gave you food, but whatever. It's yeah. fine, too um yeah but yeah welcome i can't wait to see what you make of your house and we need to have some good battles i'm, I'm anxious you. to battle you you're uh, really anxious i almost well, said will I, i'm doing a challenge on here grazer so whenever one of my pokemon faints it's considered dead and i can't use it again that what? starts that starts once i get pokeballs no yep what if your pokemon just loses a battle like a fluke then he's dead and you never use bulba fed again i would never use bulba fed again Get off this server. I don't want you here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> well, Grazer, for the next episode, episode two, I want you to be the first person I battle. Yes! Let's so go! So you can I'm kill ready. off some of my Pokemon. You can kill off all my Pokemon. So let's say I kill off your starter. Oh, I guess you have balls, so you can go and... Well, don't you need to make them weak before you capture them, though? And you, you need a need Pokemon to. for that. Uh, so you're just gonna go... This is hardcore, H. This yeah, really hardcore. I've, I've done Pixelmon so many times before, it's time to add an ultimate challenge to it. All right, sounds good. Well, we'll see, my man. Let's. Uh, I'm. I wish you the best of luck. But I think if you battle me, my level one fifty one Pikachu will pretty much. Get do rid do of you me. not think I'm gonna grind to beat you, Razor? Oh, you don't think I'm and gonna it's a grind? P it's a Pikachu. It's not <laughs> really that good, Grazer. <laughs> yeah, but you have no idea. I could probably find a Rayquaza if I tried. And then what? 
I, I mean, then you win, I guess. Yeah. But don't exactly. find a Rayquaza. Do you think you can capture a Rayquaza right now? Hold on, I'm just getting seeds and stuff because I need food. Okay. Uh, yes, yeah, so if I found a Rayquaza level like 50, I'd probably be able to capture him. I don't think it's going to be level 50. I think it's going to be more level 70. And every oh, time. Oh, are they only like level 70 and above? <laughs> uh, maybe. I don't know. I haven't played this game in a while. It's been. It's been a fat minute for me, but thank you for the help, Grazer. I'll see you minute. next episode. All right, peace. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm still getting set up. We're still getting going. I started smelting things. There's just random lag whenever I look certain directions. Like, look, I'll look this way, and then I'll look back this way, and it's fine. Like, you feel that lag? You feel that intensity? And then you look this way, and it's completely fine. I don't know what's over there. Or why is it causing frame rate issues? But I'll we'll worry about that at a different time. Right now, I need to go caving. I, I need to get iron. Iron's like the one thing that I desperately need. I, I have more food than this. I got like everything I basically... Actually, no, I don't. I need wood. Oh, yikes. I need wood for torches. I'm used to caving without torches, but we have like my gamma all the way down? All the way up? One or the other? Some way or another? We need wood. I need to make a... An axe. I need to ask you a question. I love this. It's not making any noise right now, as far as I can hear. But I love this. This makes me very happy. So if I remember correctly, we need... Oh, I didn't bring everything. Link. This is Link. He's got to go down now. Good boy. Goodbye. Um, we need a stone button. That's the one part I don't have, actually, which is kind of annoying. We do have two Ultra Ball lids, so it means we can make two Ultra Balls. So what I'm going to do... Let's finish this up, and then I'm, actually I'm gonna make a few more. I'm gonna I'm gonna make five. I want five at least. We're gonna capture our first Pokemon. Then the Nuzlocke starts. Uh, <laughs> uh, this is where it's gonna get scary. <laughs> All right. Well, this is a uh, yellow boss that I will not be taking on. This is like the top tier bosses. That's not just an Audino. That is called a Mega Audino, which. God knows I'm not going to be able to defeat with just my Bulba Fett, of course. <laughs> uh, we smelt... Oh, I could do even more than this. Hang on. So the rules we're going to be putting into place is for the Nuzlocke, it's not just I walk in and see them. I have to announce that I'm walking into a biome. So we're doing the Plains biome first. And what I'm going to do is... Okay, no, I do have enough. Perfect. What I'm going to do is we are going to walk away because I know the spawns around here and I, I kind of want to be like surprised. So let's call... I'm going to go out of the biome that way and then come back around like there. And that's where we'll see the first Pokemon. The other thing is it's got to be... I'm making this rule just because there's a lot of like different levels going on, especially with other players around. I think when there's like a higher level or like player with higher level Pokemon, higher levels will spawn. For capturing the first Pokemon in each route, it's gotta be either five levels above or below that. So I have to find a Pokemon that is level, okay, now it's the first one that I see. I'm gonna look down. So it's gotta be level 29 or below in order for me to capture them. I have six Ultra Balls. It's a Marie. I'll take that. Marie. It's a Marie. That might have spawned in the forest, but I saw, found them in the, bo the biome, it's fine. We're capturing this Marie. Uh, we're f tackle should not kill. It should not, but I'm just going to leech seed. We're just going to leech seed. We're going to play the smart. This is level 15. This is a low level too. We're going to growl. The reason I'm growling is to like, A, stay alive, which I'm not going to die from this Marie. But B, I want to get her a little bit lower with the leech seed before uh, I start chucking ultra balls which now i will start doing once she's in the yellow yellow and green does make a big difference ultra ball this should just be caught it's a marine it's a marine this is why i wanted to start in a plains biome because i knew the pokemon in there were going to be fairly easy to capture now go cat go catch a pokemon there you go all right, we have to name the Marie. I'm gonna go heal before I do anything else either bef beforehand, just in case. I don't want to run into Pokemon. I'm actually terrified of this now. The Nuzlocke has started. Why is the? It, it's gotta be like the Apricorns. The Apricorns are causing frame rate issues for me. Don't don't fight me, please. They're doing some stuff in here. They're doing some resurrecting, if you know what I'm saying, with them fossils. 
They doing some stuff in here. I'm just gonna scooch my way out of here. Don't mind me. I need to start grinding up my Pokemon. First things first, how do I... Yikes, okay, I don't remember how to change my Pokemon. Ah, it's just up and down. That's easy enough. I shouldn't, I should have been able to know that. Level one Rattata. Perfect. Come here. We're gonna use our Marie for the first time. I do have to name her as well. Or is it him? You know what? We're gonna name him. Oh god, I don't wanna fight a Persian. I'm so scared of just fighting Pokemon in general right now. It's, oh, there's a Buneary. I'd love to have a Buneary. I'm safe up here. <laughs> Nothing safe. <laughs> We're gonna name, this is my new rapping Marie. It's gonna be Lil Eep. Lil Eep. You know, like the other Pokemon? Lil Eep. The fossil Pokemon, conveniently enough. That I just may have saw or may not have. I don't know. All right, Lily. This is a level 50, 20 Spiro. You're not going to get one shot. There we go, Lily. There we go, Lily. <laughs> Take it on the big dogs. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for episode one. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, be sure to leave a like. This is going to be very difficult. I am terrified. I'm going to be streaming this tomorrow. I might be doing some off camera. Um, grinding on here, not levels wise, but grinding for like materials and stuff like that. Because I do want to get more ultra balls and that kind of stuff. It's necessary. It's very, very necessary. But I do want to get all this stuff off camera. Or not off camera. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to live stream a lot tomorrow probably. So go follow me on Twitch. Stay tuned to that. I'm excited. I'm very excited for this series. I hope you guys are too. But anyways, get out of here. <gasps> Yenaklin. Sigh.